Being at the Canada World Cup was really amazing. It was incredible to be a part of it and it was one of them you had to pinch yourself kind of moments to actually feel that you were there and you were part of the squad. Just had my scout report through on Bristol City. We get quite a lot of free time between training, matches. I spent a lot of my time on, on Football Manager. I'm more of a dots lady, works better for me. So I would rooming with Tony Duggan and she always knew when I was winning, getting all wound up. Go on, go on, cross it in. Yes! I chickened out a little bit. I, I started off playing as the Gunners as a kind of a safe bet. They played the way that I would want to play and forward attacking thinking football. 4-0 I'm winning now. I always saw myself as, you know, being a nice person, a calm, cool manager. I was like that until we had the game against Crew in the, in the League Cup and, you know, we were 2-0 down and coming at half time and I give them the whole hair dryer treatment. I press the aggressive button. I'm gonna go with direct passing gonna go for the win. We ended up winning the game on penalties and at full time I brought the team in, I wasn't happy, I, I felt that like we should have won the, won the game comfortably against them so I gave them another bit of a, a mad moment. Next thing I know I'm getting handed in transfer requests from half the back line. I've got Lauren, I've got BFG, I've got Nacho, I just couldn't believe it. And whenever I watch them now on TV I, I feel like they've let me down personally and that they've cheated me a little bit and that's all because of Football Manager.